Hey, John Baker here from RotacRepair.ca. I am in the shop today in Whitby, and I thought I would do a short video on gapping spark plugs. So do we have the right spark plugs? This is for a 503. Uh, they're NGKs, they're resistors. That's good. VR80S, yeah, those are the correct for the dimensions, the thread, so it's the right size spark plug. It has a solid top. That's what we're looking for. And now we need to gap it. So I can gap it the way I think some people do and just smash it with a tool to bend the gap down. And by the way, this is the gap that it was when I took it out of the engine. It's a 40,000 seven inch, way too much. Now, how this tool works, really cool. So we install the spark plug, thread it in, and it stops there and we can see, we can keep the paper behind there. So I'm going to screw this down and you can see now it's bending the side electrode down and I'm using an 18,000 uh, of an inch feeler strip because I always use 18 thousandths because it's in the middle of the specification and oh it's really close. Take it easy when you get to this part because it's easy to go too far. Oh, I want just a little teeny bit more, just a bit. Oh, it's sort of springing back. Oh yeah, there we go. That's what I want. 18 thousandths of an inch, good gap. Then we'll remove the spark plug and then we can do the next one. And again, I'm gonna just screw it in the little tool here. This one's going to be a little more difficult. Oh no, I think you can still see the gap through there. It was super wide. These gaps, these spark plugs came out of an engine and they were gapped at 40 thousandths of an inch. Yeah, it's kind of too much. Um, double the maximum um, gap that it should have. So uh, it's having a starting issue? Yeah, I guess it would. These uh, ignition systems are very durable. They work very, very well, but they only put out so much power and there we go and that one's done already so isn't that nice you don't have to stand there and you know bash it on the table or bash it with the pliers or ratchet or whatever you happen to be using very nice controlled method to do that and i'm happy all these spark plugs are capped at 18 thousandths of an inch i will put some thread paste on them and i will put them back in the engine that's my tip for the day. So thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you have a great day. Please hit the subscribe and notify button. And if you like, share it with one of your friends. Thanks for watching. Bye.